Welcome to Toffee TV. We've had loads of your video submissions in this week. So let's start with Jim from Solly Hall. All right, lads, it's Jim Moe in Solly Hall. I was wondering with uh, Morgan Schneiderlin starting the last couple of games, whether you think he really has maybe got a future at Goodison with Marco Silva? Morgan Schneiderlin. Interesting. The man. Interesting. Um, obviously, played in the last couple of games. Mm. Two clean sheets. Yeah. Two starts for him. Um, do you think he can resurrect his Everton career? Has he not resurrected it already? Oh, I don't think he has. I think no. he's played two games. <laughs> but he's come in, and it's it's no secret that the defence has looked a little bit tighter with him sat in front of it. Um, he's done okay in the two games, hasn't he? I thought. I thought he tired against Liverpool second half, uh, but I thought for an hour or so he was decent. You know, we had a good game. Um, he's shown a willingness to want to do well in the in the team. I think. You know, don't. But the other thing we have to remember is just he lost his dad, and you don't know how that affected. And he had a baby. And he had a baby, so he had two major things in his life, life, life changing events, both of them for different reasons, coupled with not playing well and people getting on his back. So. You know, I'm not giving them an excuse or a way out, but what I'm saying is they are, they are too life pretty changing big events, things, aren't they? Which may have affected this form. And also the team, you know, was we were we were we were probably expecting a bit more from the team than what he was showing, I would say. And then obviously we wanted Andre Gomez in there. But since he's come back in, he's done okay. And and who knows if he's got a career. I mean, I don't know, I think Everton will still Probably one upgrade in the summer, but at the moment he's doing well. Uh, Marco Silva came in, and when he came in, he said he wanted to keep him. Yeah. He said he liked them, mm. and I think, I think there's just been the perfect storm. I really, I think what we've tried to do, listen, of course, is we tried to move the team on. We brought on Jay Gomez in, and for the most part, that's been positive. Mm. On Jay Gomez has stopped. He he dipped, mm. and when he dipped, we dipped. Mm. Yeah. You know, as a team, when he came into the team, he 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 freshened it up and he helped push us on a little bit, but then he had his dip. This has played enough pre season. And we've seen that but I think I think for me, Snyder coming in has been a positive thing because I think that that ha helped address some of the problems. I, to be honest, I wish Morgan Snyder might have been you know, I might have Played in games like Millwall and some games over Christmas where we needed to freshen it up. Mm. Maybe him personally wasn't at that stage at the at the time. Maybe the manager wasn't at that stage where he thought well he had to re readdress everything. Mm. I think the seventeen days off he had probably give the manager and the players who weren't playing time to for him to look at. Because don't forget if you're playing every four or five games or even less and you don't get a proper chance to look at your players and assess your players, then it must be difficult. Mm. And I think the manager that that time has given him time to look at everything and maybe go over some tapes and go, well, what does he do and what does he do and what can he help us with? And I think what, what Snardling helps us with is, I think he's good in the air. Mm. So from a set-piece point of view, he's he knows what his job is. Mm. And I think, I think, listen, we all, we all want to have great players who can do this job and that job but when it's not working sometimes you've just got to go back to what the basics are and he probably feels that Snyder is that kind of player that can can sit in that front of the back four and just allow Garns to go and do his job but just have that protection and with better players put it this way with the Snyder in the team Sigurdsson can do what he wants mm. like literally what he wants 